humanity uh, Putting truth in these lines Why they busy feeding lies When you got that tunnel vision Gotta open up your eyes Wake up and go to sleep Man, I'm praying all times And to my guys, ain't no other side This for my brothers, I'ma pray with y'all shine Lock the door Go ahead, lock the door. Lock, mm. lock the door. You, 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 you. Go ahead, lock the door. Yeah, you already know. Depending on the lessons, lessons. some people some eat. People some people learn, but the game is going to send you a big, big. Lock the door. Professor Melvin Hill Post, man, back with Cartoon. How do you anticipate today's influence on games? Um, how do I anticipate today's influence? Because they're influenced by yeah, they influence by. Oh, okay, okay. Now I understand. You know, a little internet bit is all. Awesome. It's, it's that's one of that's one of the things that that got L.A. messed up, homie. Uh, I'm not a big fan of rap. I like the old school rap, but this new school uh, drill music out these different states. Um, music is one of matter of fact, it ain't one of music is the biggest influence on black culture. These the, man, these youngsters, they hear it and they see these videos. How they dressing in the videos, that's how they want to dress. How they talking in the videos, that's how they want to talk. You know, I've been, I've been asked people a lot, when did, when did we as Angelinos start saying is all the time? Like, who is you? Or, or who is they? We ops didn't, we, and yeah, all that stuff. Well, we didn't not yet, we didn't either. ops and, uh, and all that. But we didn't talk like, we never said who is or like uh, what your name is. Or we, didn't, we didn't speak like that until... The, the southern rap scene took over people hearing it in the music repetitively start talking that way we wouldn't say who is you we would say who are you and but the, because of the influence of rap and um what they see going on in chicago a lot and in the south and they adopted it that's why they dress funny now they they do different stuff now and so the, the influence is different they're not influenced by the big homies no more because the big homies been stuck in the pen for the last 20 30 years with a hundred to life so now they just latching on to anything to be influenced by. Hey, go back to my earlier question again. Trends. Trends. You see, it's trends. Yeah, it's a lot it's of trends. trends. It's trends. Okay, but um, what challenges do you, uh, I just asked you that one. Um, no, I did. Did I actually? No. What challenges do you foresee them in the future now that the future is here and all these different trends and all this stuff? So is it growing or do you feel like it's going in <laughs> another direction? Another direction. The um the LA the LA that I grew up in. Now when I say LA, y'all know everybody know. When I say when I say LA, I'm basically speaking on Southern California because to me, LA is Compton, Watts, Gardena, Inglewood, South Central, West LA. For me, all that's LA. Even though everything everybody has their different they different, you know what I'm saying, ideologies and sections. When I say LA, just for y'all who don't understand me, I'm speaking on South Central, Compton, Watts, all of that, Carson, all of that. So anyway, um, I jumped off my train of thought. Oh, yeah, but the, like I say, the LA that, that I grew up in, it ain't going to never come back. It's not. They, You know, they say everything makes a full circle. It'll make a circle to probably come back to have some type of semblance of it, but it won't never come back to what it used to be because the brothers – that was raised in Southern California in them 70s. <laughs> they don't make them like that no more, homie. <laughs> they don't make us like that no more. So is it fair to say that being a crip of blood has become a place of ignorance for those who don't want to study who they really are? Um, well, asking me that question, I'm gonna say no. Because I don't I'm not I'm not one that advocates that advocates gang violence and all that no more. Mm -hmm. But I'm not, my thing is, I'm not going to never tell or try to influence people to go be a cripple of blood mm -hmm. like I did when I was younger. Mm -hmm. But I still always say anybody that listen to me that I sell them, if you choose to make that decision, if you choose to make that decision, don't be no buster with it. If you're going to make that move, if you're going to make that decision, 
make it 100, man. Be the best that you can be. If you if you making that decision because of the people that are around you, you just playing with it. Don't do it. Man, go do something else. Go to school. Go learn something. Go get your job. Cartoon, what are your hopes for the future for the kids? <laughs> That man, we just come together, stop killing each other, man. All get along, whether you blue or red. You could, because I say all the time, man, you can, you can, you can be whatever your tribe is. You can be that. Just because you're a cripple blood, don't mean you got to be killing each other. You know what I'm saying? We can get along. That you represent that, okay? I'm representing this, cool. But we ain't got to have animosity to each other where we hurt each other. So, what do you believe we can achieve long term if we stay in this scenario or this grouping or collective? Man, to me. The sky's the limit, homie. For real. The sky's the limit because if you're going to do something positive, if you're going to do something to build your community, if you're going to do something to build your city or where you're from, just because you're a cripple blood don't mean you can't do it. Man, I, you got homies that are in gang intervention. You got homies buying up stuff, trying to open up businesses and all that, and they still part of what they're part of. Being a cripple blood don't make you ignorant. Being a cripple blood don't make you a bad person. The things you do while you are associated with this is what makes you what you are, whether you stupid or whether you good. I agree. With that being said, I appreciate you just sit down and we got we talked about it quite a few things. And once again, I'm Professor Melly Mel. He what? Cartoon 5-3, man. And we're going to lock the door. Lock it, cartoon. Man, go ahead, man. Bolt them shut, homie. Lock the door. Kelly Miners, baby. <laughs> Proof of grind all the time. Music money. Got a dollar sign. Hub City. I'm a street nigga. Streets fuck with me. I'ma keep pushing products till the fans get me. It's Guap off top. Diamond Cordier. That nigga wall won't give a pro bitch the time of day. They see me climbing. They see me, they see me shining. They see me. That's hard work. Hard work. Proof of grinding. Go big, grind now, nigga, play later What can I say? I'm addicted